historic election for Indiana State Senate. Democrat J.D. Ford will be the first openly gay state lawmaker, beating a staunch conservative Mike Delf, a strong opponent of gay marriage. Joe Melillo has that part of our coverage this morning. Joe. Good morning. Yeah, a first in Hoosier State history and a significant one to say the least. Last night, J.D. Ford claimed victory at the Democratic Party headquarters inside the Hyatt downtown with 53% of the vote becoming the first openly LGBTQ plus person ever elected to the Indiana General Assembly. The 36-year-old Democrat ran against Delph four years ago and lost. Ford campaigned on increasing the minimum wage and passing a hate crime law. Indiana is only one of five states without a state without a state hate crime law and Mike Delf had opposed the law in the General Assembly. Now we did talk to Ford shortly after he was declared the winner last night. I think people really connected to my message. I think people really connected to um, our platform. Um, and speaking of connecting, I connected with our voters. I went out and knocked those doors. I made those phone calls. We sent out a thousands and upon thousands of postcards. Uh, it's that personal touch that I think is really missing from our politics. Ford campaign on increasing funding for public schools, raising the minimum wage, and fighting the opioid addiction, as, as well as passing a hate crime legislation. Now, we have not received a statement from Delft, but he did post on social media yesterday afternoon that it's been an honor serving the Indiana General Assembly. And Ford will be here in our studio soon, later this morning, so stay tuned for that. Joe, thank you. There were the